What can you say about a Father's Day promotion at Sherway Gardens in which contestants were forced to watch Love Story over and over for eight hours? That's impossible. Love Story may just be the sappiest movie of all time. In it, Ryan O'Neill, a rich Harvard Law student, falls for Ali McGraw, a poor Radcliffe student. I think I'm in love with you. McGraw's character gives O'Neill a hard time, though she was one of the first to complain about the neutral zone trap. Now why the hell should I want to go to a lousy hockey game? Then it gets very sad. The man's father is a mean guy. If you marry her now, I'll not give you the time of day. There's bad news about the young wife. She's dying. And to make it even sadder, Tommy Lee Jones gets only two scenes. So to watch this movie over and over and over, could these guys do it? I love movies like this. Well, that's what makes you stupid. I'll last the whole day. Oh, how can you do it? This is torture. I can't take it anymore. Don't go off half cock, damn it. The winner from the Hallmark Romancethon receives the uh, Lazy Boy chair and the Bell Express to use satellite dish. That's wonderful. It's going, Harvey. Troops will be home for Christmas. And so they watched, and they fought back tears. I'd like to tell you which one of these brave guys won the competition today, but I, I, I just couldn't stay to the end. I, I'm sorry. Love means never having to say you're sorry. Peter Gross for City Pulse.